Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I have a very special event planned for you tonight, and I brought along Chef to the Stars, Miss Daphne. Hello, guys. So this is my partner in crime when it comes to, uh, I'm not gonna call it sketchy food experiences, but we'll call it- The unknown. The unknown. <laughs> If you guys haven't seen our uh, our incredible Mexican-inspired seafood episode from 106 Seafood Underground in Inglewood, California, make sure you check that out. But this is part two. I found this random restaurant online, and I thought this could be interesting. It was said to have three tables, and it's in a neighborhood. And I called Daphne, and I said, Daphne, you want to come and do another hidden gem with me? And she said, Hell yeah, count me in. <laughs> I'm all in. Count so, me in. So we're here. Are we in the right place? Do you guys know what we're talking about? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> you guys don't see people going in and out of some houses here? Seems like a trap. Let's go back. <laughs> this is a trap. Wow, okay. <gasps> yeah, this is it. This is a lot. Thank you. It smells like a kitchen. I can hear the music. <laughs> I'm so excited. Hello. Good Hi. evening. Garrett. What's up, Lawrence. Lawrence, nice to meet you. This Daphne. is Daphne. Daphne, how you doing? This is wow. wonderful. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So this is Mama Greens. Yes. Mama Greens, okay. There oh she god. is. Shut how are you? Hi. This is Daphne. Hi, where's your skateboard? <laughs> oh, I know. Yeah. I should have brought it. Hi, welcome, welcome. How are you? How are you? Good. Yeah, good, you guys good? good? I'm so excited good. to be here. I'm excited for you guys. Have you been cooking for a long time? Yeah, forever. Your whole but life, I yeah. started like in pastry. So oh, I was a cake decorator okay. and a custom cake decorator like for 13 years. So I'm just now transitioning into like the savory side of things. All right, Diana, tell me, yes. give me a, give me a little background of this establishment. Five years ago, my husband went on deployment. I went back home to Chicago, and my grandmother was at my parents' house, and they were her sole like caregivers. And at the time, I was just like, I really want to start a restaurant. So during that time, my grandma's in transition, so like passing away. Mm -hmm. And so when she passed, I was like, I want to name it. Mama Greens. And so from then on, I was like, you know, did my recipes and everything. So that's why it's named after her because I was with her. I wanted to feel rustic and vintage and I wanted to feel like your grandma's house. Wow. Okay. All right. Let's yeah. do this. I don't want to make anything burn. All right. Oh, oh yeah. Wow. If the bathroom is good, the food will be good. Oh, Look wow. <laughs> Yes. This bathroom is a 10. Food will oh, be a yeah. 10. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Right, so these are Mama's homemade buttermilk biscuits. Nothing fancy here, okay? This is real homeschool cooking like your grandma used to do. Okay, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh my God, Gareth, I'm making you a bite. Mmm. Honey, Honey basil, basil butter. butter. <gasps> First really bite like at yeah. Mama Green's. This is where the experience starts. You know, we're rocking and rolling when you taste that. You know, I'm, I'm serious. I know, <laughs> Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there is a lightness to that butter. All right, so we're going to start with our most popular okay. dish. So in here, we got collard greens and smoked turkey. That's it. What? And then it has to be fried. Duh. Everything's better fried. First up, sweet potatoes. <laughs> Yum. The softest melt in your mouth sweet potatoes right there. And then this. All right, so this is the mystery sauce. We're, we the don't mama talk sauce, about that. The mama sauce. But inside of this is just collard greens and turkey. And this fried chicken esque egg roll of comfort food. That crunch. You can hear the crunch. That's <laughs> Kevin. I don't know what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that thing. Wow. Do that same. Okay. Wow. Oh my. And it's got a kick to it. That's got. The I'm so skin. excited. Oh my God. Oh yeah. I'm even eating that. Mm. <laughs> that sauce is bomb. Mm. The collard greens in there. It like balances out everything. Yeah, everything. It's With like a soul food no. fried <laughs> chicken egg roll. Can I give you guys a pro tip for a second? I would recommend this place on a first date. I maybe wouldn't recommend it on, let's say, maybe a third date, or if you wanted to do anything after this. Yeah, you're not gonna do anything. You're maybe not, not, not a third anything. date location? Is that fair yeah. to say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not gonna do anything after this. Maybe a 20 year anniversary date? Yep, we have a lot of anniversaries. Third date? 
Nope, you're not doing nothing after that. Or get a soup and go home. Yeah. Get out of here. <laughs> Guys, Mama Greens, we're here. Look at the little touches. It's the light on the menu. Very nice. They really thought of everything. There's a storyline in the back. We're just yeah. friends, but this is very romantic. <laughs> I feel like I'm in a grandma's backyard in the south. All right, here we go. Classic wow, look at these big lemonades. <laughs> wow. Cheers. Cheers. To you guys. Thank you, chef. Cheers. Oh my god. It's so fresh. I can taste the sweat in your hands. Like, yes. you know, in the best way that. possible. Yeah, oh my gosh, that's amazing. We got mama's loaded. Wow. Dirty sunburn chili. Oh my Ooh. god. <laughs> and then we got one of mama's cheddar jalapeno hush puppies on the side. Yum. So we have fresh corn in there, cheddar cheese, fresh jalapeno <sighs> chopped up. The smell, if you guys yes. could smell this, I want it in a candle. We got pork, Oh. Beef. We got bacon on top, sour cream, fresh jalapenos, Kobe Jack cheese. <laughs> you got it. Here I go. Mm. Oh yeah. That slaps, man. <laughs> oh my so God. <laughs> I've never tried chili like this. Really? I love it. I love that it's like, there's steak in there. Yeah. You hear that, right? Oh my gosh. The crunch on the outside and that fresh corn. Huge chunks of steak in there. The cheese, the cream on top. That crunch. And the crunch of the hush puppy. This is the mint peach tea with a full peach. Cheers. All right, cheers. Oh, that totally tastes like a peach cobbler. What? That's a peach cobbler. Mm. How do you, it sounds like we're freaking out over a drink, but no, we're kind of freaking out over a drink. This yeah, I can't. is the best peach tea I've ever had. Okay. Very, Very grandma southern. style of cooking. I appreciate this love that she has. What? You can taste it by even just the tea that she just gave us. Like she loves what she's doing. She's representing her family. Her grandma is like right there with her and I feel it. And you can I just see like her like running around on the inside. It's, That's it's the beautiful. most fun about this. She's inside just whipping things up and we're just enjoying the moment. This is a really cool spot. All right, we're just getting started. Oh gosh, that's scary. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if you're here just regularly, you're gonna sit outside and it's beautiful. I showed you already, the lighting is nice, but these dishes don't do justice. These dishes don't do themselves. We don't do these dishes justice by sitting in the low light. I feel drunk off my soul exactly. right now. So we got catfish. Seasoned Cajun grits. Right I'm going right there. I'm that. going for the seasoned Cajun grits. I'm going catfish and the grits. Mm. Right wow. Away. Oh my seasoned? God. Seasoned? Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, I've never had grits like that. That's like a mashed potato and mac and cheese had a baby and they turned into grits. So flavorful. You hear that? Mm. The sausage in there is so bomb. All right, I want to end on this fried chicken. I got the gravy, I got the turkey, I got the fried chicken, I got the love. Wait, well, let me get a little collard green. That collard green is bomb. Nah, no, everything is so good. No. Holy crap. That is Thanksgiving in heaven at grandma's house with the gravy. That crunch. I've never had mashed potatoes with collard greens and like all of this like in my life, actually. I'm just hella Hispanic. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good though. I do also love how seasoned everything is. Like I love salt. I love seasoned stuff. I know it's perfectly seasoned. Yeah. Got my pot pie over here. Hi. This is an all butter crust. It's the best crust you will ever taste in your life. Oh yeah. <laughs> Listen, Daphne's got uh, like a chef's mouth. It's probably been burned a thousand times. I have to wait a second. You're you're wasting time. Okay? <laughs> All right, here I go. I'm going for it. Look, get to me first. Okay? What's this? Just this the sauce. sauce on the inside, <laughs> and then you mix that with that butter crust. This is the treat. It's like soup. It's like a melted butter soup. Yep. Flavored with chicken. And veggies. And spices and veggies. Granddaddy Don's <laughs> warm banana pudding. So it's named after my grandfather because when I was a kid, he made banana pudding one day uh -huh. and I loved it. And I would tell him like, I love this so much, granddad. And so the following week, he made me a big bowl of it. 
just for me, and I will never forget that. So oh. that's why I named it after oh. All right, chopped bananas. We gotta have vanilla wafers. I like the mini oh. ones because you can add more in there. And what do we got in the like base? Fresh custard, just vanilla custard, old school on the stove, nothing special. No box stuff. Custard is no joke, guys. Like, you need to know how to make a custard. Custards are no joke. Like, you have to temper your eggs. You have to, like, mm -hmm. slowly pour in the hot liquid. It really takes a lot of patience. Okay. Right now, we're we'll stirring. We're just slowing it up and just until it gets all broken. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow, what a beautiful presentation. I almost want to do this. Yeah, just get in there. <laughs> Yum. Mm. <laughs> you almost want to eat it with your eyes closed. Whoa. I'm getting like a like a s'more. Okay. Like a marshmallow and graham cracker in there with a banana. Because of that that top, it's almost like a marshmallow. Yeah. And then the banana and the custard. Growing up, my favorite dessert was vanilla custard. Just vanilla pudding, and with I would always put graham crackers in it. Oh, well, you're right at home. And this is literally <laughs> right at home. But on steroids. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Huh. Okay. Okay. What do I? Where do we go from here? What the hell? Oh, one more. What are, you, what are you gonna do next? Walk on water? Well, this is my favorite dessert. This is the most popular, actually, other than the banana pudding. So it's named after my grandmother. Her name, real name is Earlene Green. So it's a spiced green apple, and then we blanket the all butter crust, the same crust as the pot pie, but we add some cinnamon in there. We wrap it, and then we deep fry it. Land on a bed of spiced pecans, vanilla bean ice cream, fresh whipped caramel, all right? And that's not it. What? What is this? <laughs> <laughs> all right, so what we have right here, is our homemade like caramel <laughs> apple coolies. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> I love that it's not too sweet. Like that's like such a good balance. And then the fact that it's fried. Whole... See ya. No. A deconstructed, reconstructed apple crisp with the stars. I love these crunchy yeah. candy pecans, vanilla ice cream, and the whip. This really is a holiday in my mouth. That's the way to finish the meal. There you go. Oh. It's almost done. <laughs> done. <laughs> yeah. I'm out of here. Drop the fork. <laughs> I'm out of here. You knocked it out of the park. Yes. Thank you so much, Chef. Thank you. Daphne. What'd you think? Am I two for two? Killed it again. Uh, <laughs> literally, thank you. You change my palate every single time. I always try someone else's flavor that has love. You find people that love what they do and that there's passion in their food. And this is another hole in the wall that's a black diamond. Like literally, it's like the best possible. So love good it. job. Love it. Yes. That's a wrap. Mama, yeah. you should be so proud. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, Mama Green is Lawrence. where Lawrence is. You gotta ring the bell. He is the bell. Love you, boy. Lawrence, video. thank you so much. You. I'm wrapping the video here. We're gonna get wheelchaired to our car. Make sure you go check out Daphne. I'll leave all the information of Mama Green's in the video description. Subscribe if you haven't already. All that good stuff. I'll see you guys on the next one. Okay. okay. Uh, here okay. comes the security guys sitting here right now. <laughs> I'm glad that you're helping us with our stomach. You don't do this yeah. normally, right? You no, know, I, I take weeks stuff away from people all the time. All the time. Because I want to make sure you get to the dessert. I want to okay. make sure you get to everything. The full experience. Yeah. <laughs> Lawrence, Lawrence oh. is, the, is the host and also the enforcer here on <laughs> Food Count. <laughs> both, both hats. Both hats. You go too far in one dish, Lawrence comes like, that's enough out of you. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> Go ahead, I really Lauren, want take one more, but they're not making me And what's this over here? I haven't had that before. What's that one called? That biscuit is... All right, come put your... I'm already sweating. Come put your, <laughs> come put your spoon in here. <laughs> How can I best describe this to do it justice? If you love mac and cheese, you'll sh yourself with this one. <laughs> um, it's so good. This is too much. 
It's just too much. Look oil. at how you're standing, first of all. That's how you know you've been grip, I'm <laughs> gripping the sidelines here. You know what? You're such a professional. She buttons her pants back up. <laughs> <laughs> I can't breathe. I know. <laughs> no, I'm not mine. <laughs> what do you get with that sauce? Give me some. Give me some ingredients. Don't that tell me all of them. smoked paprika or paprika's in there. Uh -huh. Cayenne pepper, onion powder, garlic. Oh, yeah. All right, stop. It's stop. Stop. <laughs> I'm like, oh. All right, that's, that's enough. That'll be enough. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta be honest with you. I'm here to get in there. Oh, no. My grandma made tuna casserole. She made like a hot dog casserole. Sorry, grandma, but <laughs> this uh, this grandma wins. <laughs> I think she should have her own restaurant. That would kill it. The world needs to yeah. taste no, this. Don't tell know. anybody. Shh. <laughs> right, save, save me for yourself. <laughs> you didn't see anything here. <laughs>